Hey everybody, it is Stefan here on Gender Queer Chat. Um, um, outside, it's a little bit windy, so hopefully you can hear me okay. Um, so this week's topic is um, in India, they uh, decided to um, make a uh, third sex uh, gender box for identification and census purposes. And, um, and the first um, Indian person was uh, allowed to um, use that, um, that new rule and uh, is the first person enrolled as a member of the third gender under the unique number or unique identification number project. Um, and uh, so the question for us is, um, you know, what, what do we think about that? Um, would we like to be registered as a third, a third gender? Um, and for me, I really like that idea. Um, it, um, it's hard for me to want to fit into a male or a female box. Um, and I also think that by giving it an official status that um, we'll have a lot more research and things like that um, being published on uh, people who don't identify as male or female. Um, whether this, I don't know, I think that there's definitely some problems with ex execution of it though, um, with the logistics um, for a couple of reasons. Um, you know, first of all, I think that um, it would really depend on how society is about treating people of third gender. Um, if, um, if that's going to be used as just another way to discriminate against people, then I'm, that's not a good thing. But um, if it's, if it, you know, um, helps to kind of normalize it in a way or like help um, make it more mainstream, then that could be a good thing. And also, um, if we're talking about census information and stuff like that, um, I mean, not all transgender people identify as non-binary. So um, if you're trying to get additional information on trans people specifically, then you're still not going to capture the ones who identify as strictly male or strictly female. So, um, you know, they're obviously going to check either male or female on the gender box and not the third gender. Um, so I think there's definitely, you know, some things to think about. Um, but I would definitely like to have another option, um, especially um, since in a lot of places, um, you know, you, you can't change your gender marker on things. It would be nice to have that. Um, as an option to change, um, I and mean, people might be more receptive to that than changing from male to female or female to male. So I don't know. It's definitely something to think about and something that could have either positive or negative ramifications. So um, that's my two cents, and I look forward to seeing what everybody else has to say about it. And um, I'll post the link to the article in the side box so you can check that out. All right, thanks.